Hi everyone and welcome to Taste Test with Mike. I hope everybody's okay today. Um, it's kind of gloomy out again. It's been raining. Um, it doesn't. It's not raining right at the moment, but it could start again anytime. Uh, just yuck. You know, we've been having to stay around the house until the first of the month. We can get some more groceries and hopefully I can get some more things to try. I don't know. We haven't been to our Dollar Tree. Um, they were supposed to have gone up the 21st. We haven't been there in quite a while. But we may have to go over there and check it out and see if they've got anything different. That Now, if they had something different, I might be more willing to try it that uh, is a dollar twenty-five. But anyway, today we're trying, or I'm trying... I think Logan said he wanted to try some of them too. They're uh, Fisher Boy. There's 12 fish sticks made from minced fish. Um, I haven't had fish sticks. I can't tell you the last time I ever had fish sticks. Really, we need to eat more fish though. We really do. The last fish we had was some, uh, some type of encrusted, uh, I don't know what kind of fish it was, a flounder, I think, or something like that from Aldi. And it was it was fantastic. And that's been quite a while ago, so we, we need to eat more fish. But let's see what the nutrition facts are on these. Hi, Kitty. How are you? You've been asleep until now. She's been asleep all since this morning. If you eat eight of them, there's 12 in here. Uh, there's 300 calories. Um, 12 grams of total fat is 16%, 2 grams of saturated fat is 10%, no trans fat, 15 milligrams of cholesterol is 5%, it's got 670 milligrams of sodium, that's 29%, it's just par for the course for all these meals and things. Um, 34 grams of carbs is 12%, 3 grams of fiber is 12%, there's 3 grams of total sugars and 2 grams added sugars is 5%, it's got 12 grams of protein, that's 20%, and 4% of calcium, 10% of iron, and 8% of potassium, so they're not, not that bad, really, the sodium is just something you can't get away from, it seems like. But it contains uh, cod, pollock, haddock, sole, and whiting. I wonder why so many different things to make a fish stick. Uh, and then it's got a whole list of, you know, when you see this many ingredients, I don't know if you can, maybe if I move my hand, there like that. When you see that many ingredients, it's pretty, pretty processed. <laughs> You can see what I'm talking about there. I don't want to name it all off, but, but that is a lot of ingredients for a fish stick. Okay, I'm going to... Press anything, please. They actually don't even have instructions for uh, the microwave, which I would never try these in the microwave anyway. So. I'm going to fix these in the oven and be right back to try them. I'll have to have some tartar sauce though. <laughs> okay, see you in a sec. Hey, I just wanted to show you what they look like. I was kind of surprised. I mean, I remember fish sticks. I mean, I've had them, had them, we had them for years. You know, the kids used to love them. And uh, they've gotten a lot smaller. <laughs> look. Okay, there's my hand. It's not even as big as my finger. <laughs> okay, I just thought I'd show you before I put them in the oven. I was like, okay. They're more like uh, fish fries. I would call them fish fries, maybe. <laughs> okay. Okay, here they are. There was actually 13 in this one. So, bonus day, baker's dozen. They, they really are kind of small. <laughs> and I got some tartar sauce right here. A little, they're easy to dip anyway, that way. Mm. 
Crunchy. Mm. Let me try one without the charge top. Or try a bite. They're real easy to, to dip and stuff. This would be good like if you had some other finger foods, maybe. French fries. Gosh, they're really pretty good, y'all. I'm... I'm Surprised, really, that they taste this good. One thing I noticed, they come from New Hampshire. So they're made in the United States. I'd say if we had two, I'd say if you had two boxes, you might be able to make it for three people. But you might even just need one box per person if there's 12 in it because they're smaller. But I'll tell you what, they taste good. I'm very, I'm very surprised. I didn't think they would taste that good. Um, like I said, I haven't had them in a long time. But I would eat these again, you know, and being from Dollar Tree, I don't know what, a box, I don't know if you could find that small of a box, you know, in the gross, you know, regular grocery store. Uh, but I don't know, I know you can get fish, fish sticks pretty cheap though, um, elsewhere. I think Aldi has some, too. But... You know, uh, they are good though. So if you if you do want to try them out, I, I would recommend it if you if you like fish. Um, like I said, we need to eat more. We don't hardly ever eat fish, and it's it's really good for you. So the only thing you know, like I said, is the salt maybe, but. That's like everything else. I think the the fat's pretty low. Really, like I said, the only issue would be salt. It's got lots of protein. So for eight of them, three hundred calories. I don't, I don't know. That's that's close to what another meal would be, I guess. I, I'm going to give this... I'm going to go ahead and give this a five. I mean, really, a five out of five, because uh, I, I'm very surprised. They do taste good. I mean, even though they're small, you get 12 of them. And there was 13 in this one. Uh, that would be enough for one person, for sure. Uh like I said, two, you might be able to, but you'd only have eight a piece. But that's the serving size. But I don't know if that's enough to fill me up, eight of them. I just sat here and ate three. 
just now and I could easily eat the rest of these so I would imagine you need one box probably per person um, if you if your kids are like we were growing up we loved them I mean that's when I used to mainly eat them just you know when I was younger but I I haven't tried them in years and I'm, I'm very surprised that they they got a good taste they're not real real fishy taste either um, just a good taste I mean um, I, I can't eat fish if it's if it's real fishy tasting I just can't I can't eat it but um, anyway I'm very surprised in these five out of five um, I didn't expect them to be as good as they are to me no like I like I want to mention in every taste test that everybody's uh, taste buds are different you know uh, you might not like you might like something I don't like more or you might like it less than I do or I just uh, give everybody my opinion and you got some things to work with and the uh, nutrition facts you know and some idea of what it's what it's like so so check them out if you'd like to try them and uh, you'll find them at Dollar Tree and I hope you enjoyed this taste test with Mike if you did I hope you'll press that like button also subscribe if you haven't already and hit that so you get all my videos as soon as they come out and share this out today thanks so much everybody and i'll be seeing you later on god bless